in the middle of nowhere. Red Cross officials start their census in this Roma camp that doesn't appear on any map. 13 Romanian families have been living here for three months. Questions are asked about their health, education and general living conditions. Violetta has now identification cards for all her family. She wants to stay in Italy hoping that their life will improve. In Romania, we had no work, we had nothing. We didn't have a house like this. We used to sleep outside on the ground. The controversial census in the nomadic camps started in Naples and in Milan has led to international protest. Here in Rome, the government has backtracked. There are no fingerprints being taken and no question asked about religious belief or ethnical background. But there is some distrust with people refusing to answer the questions by fear that the xenophobic fringes of the government will not just use the census for social improvements. They're doing that because they want to expel us. What else are we supposed to think? That's what everyone's thinking, yeah? In response, the Red Cross reaffirms its neutrality. We've never seen the Red Cross involved in a police action anywhere in the world, but I think that what we're doing here could be repeated elsewhere in Europe. Italy has launched an emergency on the Roma people who crystallized all the blames against immigrants here from taking advantage of the system to being children thieves. By October, the government wants to know where and how they live in three major Italian cities, with questions asked on how this will resolve the emergency.